want him outside. Now for today, I, oh, there we go. For today, I am dreading, dreading, dreading my idea. I wanna do a transformation video and I have a very specific idea of what I wanna transform into and it's gonna be really difficult and I'm probably gonna even need some help to finish it. But I've had this idea for a while and I really wanna try it because I really think it's gonna be cool. So I'm gonna try to go for it and see how it turns out. So watch me go from this to this. <laughs> or stop watching because that was terrifying. Won't judge you either way. I guess I'm gonna set everything up and get started and see how this uh, how this one goes. I'm always so worried that, well, you know what, to be fair, when you're stuck at home all the time trying to make entertaining videos because you're so bored you can't put out your creative energy anywhere else, it's a chaos storm. A storm of chaos that could go wrong at any time. I mean, the, this, we saw, we saw how wrong things could, we know how wrong things could go. Here we go, I guess. Woo! Alrighty, I've got my black tank top on as usual. I've got everything set up for the most part, I think. So, as this, wherever it is, as that is the look. Wow! So I think I'm gonna do kind of a neutral face and then really focus on some darkness kind of around the sides of the face and the eyes and really these just dramatic lashes and, of course, the white contacts. That's really why this was such a daunting look from the beginning, so um, we'll see. I might accomplish it, it might be a disaster, but we're gonna try. So the real question is, is this more of a makeup video than a transformation video just because I'm not doing body paint? And the answer is, shh, don't talk. I'm gonna try to stay in frame this time because <laughs> I did not do that in the last video. Here's the thing, I have to glue my brows down because she doesn't have brows. And I'm really bad at gluing my brows down. So I'm either gonna have to glue them down or shave them off. So um, I'm gonna give that a go first before I do anything else. And if that doesn't work out, you may uh, get to watch me shave my eyebrows off. So let's uh... That's what I did not want to make it, Ganja. Well, how am I supposed to feel in this moment? Ganja, I didn't want to make it that everybody was attacking you. I feel very attacked. This is just, this is this. So, um, I'm out of options, so they're gonna have to go. But that's exciting content. Wow, what a look. I can, I can do no eyebrows now. What a look, I'm kind of into it. I should be more shocked by things like this, but I've, it's, it's been a long life. <laughs> I am like full naked mole rat vibes. I love it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and powder myself down a bit. Probably too much powder, but there's so much real estate now. <laughs> it's hard to tell when too much is. Anything that grows back or changes fast, like hair color or eyebrows, I'm very, Pro, a proponent of like, just do you. Like, go for it. Who says you can, you know? They'll grow back in a couple of weeks, as far as I know. I mean, it'll be hilarious if I just never have eyebrows again, but like, worse things could happen to me, you know? So I'm gonna prime the lids with something pretty pale, and um, yeah, we'll go from there. We'll see how this develops. All right, so we've got the base. I mean, I don't want to go too dark in the browns because I think I'm going to pretty much turn this a bit more gray uh, since, like I said, the charcoal -y vibes in the pencil. So on to the grays now.
Alright, so I'm liking the base of the eyes right now. Um, the sides of her face are quite dark, so I think I'm gonna start darkening the sides of my face and then revisit what's going on in the middle. Might add some shimmer, because like I always say with these, it's just kind of the essence of the look. It's not just, you know, a direct recreation because I'm not, this is as shaved as my head is going to get. I've already shaved off my eyebrows for this one. So they're fun anyways, even if they're not perfect. But yeah, I like how this is going. So I'm going to start contouring and such on my face. So it's kind of a mix of contouring and uh, just darkening the face, adding some grays and browns, because I kind of want to keep it sort of natural toned, but add that kind of... I have said this like six times, you know what I'm doing. I just, if I, is it fun to just watch the makeup? Don't, do we, we should interact, right? Like, how are you? Ah, oh, I see, okay, wow. I don't know what you said. This is what we've got so far. So I'm gonna start working on the finer details. The eyeliner. Oh, the lips too. I have to work out the lips. Alright. Now that I think we're done with the eyes, up to the lashes. Let's do the little circle design. All right, that's uh, that's the vibe. Let's get the contacts in, <laughs> if we can. All right, we succeeded with one eye. Yeah, from there, <laughs> we just have to try and do the second side and pray that it works out, because this is, this is a challenge. Oh, I forgot the lips. <laughs> oh yeah, kind of like this actually. Ooh, that kind of worked. All right, well, we're contact up, so I'm gonna get help with the second eye and then off to the races. This was a mess, as are all of my ideas at some point, but um, it's still kind of cool. So I'm happy. I had a lot of help from my mom, so shout out to mom. Thanks for helping me get this somewhere. Transformations are fun. I mean, you know, messy and irritating, and my eyes were difficult to work with today, but I mean, hey, I'm, you know, I'm a doodle. I'm a witchy girl. You'll see the glamour shots. You've seen the glamour shots, one of those things. But thanks so much for watching. And uh, yeah, thanks for being here. Thanks for the journey. Thanks for the journey. Thank you for being on this journey with me. It has been quite a journey today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. You know what? To be honest, even this is quite a look. <laughs>